So anybody who has played around with Iridium decoding in the past has probably encountered this error before. Play Iridium Ambi not found. This is a problem caused by Linux not knowing where the Play Iridium Ambi bash script is located. And it will throw this error in the terminal window when we try to replay Iridium voice transmissions. We can rectify this by adding the path to the Iridium Toolkit programs file on our bash RC file. Now it's a bit of a mouthful, I understand, but just please follow along with me. So in the terminal window now, we'll turn our attention back to it and I'll copy and paste the following command. And don't forget that I'll put all the comment, uh, the commands that I run in the description of this video and probably in the top pinned comment. So I'll just uh, hit enter on that. And this will open a text editor inside our terminal window once again. And we need to navigate to the very bottom of the file. So I'll just press down the down key on my keyboard and we'll go right to the end of the document. And then we need to add this line here to the very bottom of the document. So I'll just copy and paste that. So yeah, emulate this exact thing that I'm doing here. And then again, to quit uh, the text editor, we will press Control X. Oops, sorry, Control X. We press Y on the keyboard and then Enter key. Now this next step is very important. In order for the changes we made to become active, we need to quit our terminal window and then relaunch it. So I'll go ahead and do that and we can move on to the practical segment of the tutorial, finally. So yeah, quit the terminal window, relaunch it, and then the previous changes we made will now become active. 